Hi, this is Sasha Segan from PCMag.com with Windows Phone 7. Here's a quick demo of Windows Phone 7's new features. Take it away. Um, so this is Windows Phone 7 series start experience. Um, and this really highlights a couple aspects of um, what Windows Phone 7 series is going to bring to, to mobile. Um, the first is smart design. So you can see it's a very simple design, but it's also very active. And so each of... This is the lock screen. Um, a simple pull up and you get back to the start screen. You can see it's very f simple, very flat, it's, um, but all of them are very dynamic. So what you have here is the order I chose, so f um, phone, people, uh, my email, my corporate email account, exchange, games, pictures, and I scroll down you can see um, a lot of other of these live tiles, including the hubs that I'll get into in a second. So you can pin people, web pages, even music to the home screen? That's right. And so I'll I'll actually show you that. It'll go into the People Hub. Those little pictures were your favorite people, I take it? Um, so they actually... Uh, I, there is a bias towards recent, but it'll go through your entire people list. So all you have to do is you go in your People Hub and pin to start, and that person will appear on your home screen. And so this, this start screen is completely customizable. So if I, I just pin this Alan Brewer to my start screen, I can delete him, his live tile, or I can elevate him and move him anywhere I want in that um, experience. Apparently if you delete him, you're breaking his heart. <laughs> I'm not sure if that iconography is final. Um, and so the other thing you see here is, is one, it's, it's very dynamic, there's things moving, there's lots of different types of content, um, but it's glanceable in a lot of different ways. So this has my latest calendar appointment, um, my Xbox Live has my uh, avatar moving, I'm not sure why you need that, but also, it, so right now this is not... Um, a phone connected to real people, these are all dummy data, but if Alan Brewer changed his photo on Facebook or added a status update on Windows Live, that actually appears in the tile. Um, if I get a text message, it appears in the tile. If I get an email, it appears in the tile. So things become extremely um, glanceable and you can work with just the, the, the start screen. So Facebook and other social networking updates flow into all the various hubs, all the various areas? That's right, and that actually brings me to the, the next big piece of what we've, we announced today with, with Windows Phone 7 series, and that's the hubs. And the hubs really speak to kind of our, the new concept we're bringing to the phone. So I showed you a little bit of the people hub, um, just showing you the contact list. But if you scroll over um, past the contact list, you see what's new. And so instead of a separate Facebook app, a Windows Live app, a MySpace app, all of that information is aggregated um, with people. And similarly, and so that includes if they updated photos on a social network. Um, so you can see that as a what's new view, or if you click into any one of these people, that's part of their contact. Their photo will change their, you know, if they change their mobile. Um, so Zoom and Xbox Live are also examples of hubs, right? That's right. So um, there are actually six hubs. There's people, there's games hub. Um, it's not the Xbox Live hub because there are many games that will be available on Windows Phone 7 series. There's pictures. There's the music and video. And again, it's not the Zune hub because there are, um, there, it'll integrate a number of different ser music services. Um, and then there's the Office hub and the Marketplace hub. And the Office hub has all the Microsoft Office apps. Uh, this even supports multiple exchange accounts, right? That's right. Uh, multiple exchange accounts as well as Pop. Popmail accounts. So when are these phones coming to market? Um, these phones will be available on holiday 2010. So I click okay. the pictures out here. So we'll find out more about uh, Windows Phone 7 between now and then? Uh, you'll find out a lot more. Um, today is really just the beginning of what, uh, what we have to share. Okay, thanks a lot. This is PCMag.com with Windows Phone 7.